Good morning. What's up? Another beautiful day here is Sunday morning, George Sangayano. Yesterday we went on a trip to Wakenham Island. We had an awesome time. We got up like 6 a.m. just to go across here. The weather was so bad, but we made it in the end. The weather was beautiful in the afternoon. We had an awesome time. We get home like 9 p.m. last night. This morning, everybody's sleeping. We don't know what to do, if to relax a day or to do something fun. But you know, I'm always adventurous. Nonetheless, we wanna run down to Montrose, where we gonna, um, you know, we gotta check out, do some maintenance work on a, on a property there. Guess what I take him with me? And I plan to, to invite the fishing crew, you know. If they buy fishing, they gonna bring some fish we gonna fry. But over here, I got a nice outdoor stove, man. I'm going to buy Robin Cromwell, send me the stove and you know I got these couple bottle of things here I ain't really got use for them so I um, think I'm going to drink them out today you know alright and we're going to check out my buy Robin Cromwell the same man who sent the stove for me we're going to check out his property alright so join me and let me go have some fun on the east coast in the meantime let's show you what's going on boy now you see this file pan and, and things there and all this seasoning and thing and we little frying pan and so pepper sauce bong tea guess what we got in we got in by the yard we're gonna fry some fish you know i hope the fisherman catching fish out on the jetty there now yesterday my uncle my cousin if we can give you all this lovely egg ball and cassava ball we're gonna lash it for breakfast and look what my girl message doing by. I tell you, you don't know your wife like this no more, you know. They don't make those models no more. Alright. Nice catfish go read there by. We got some rice bubble in there. Man. Life couldn't get better. I gotta lash my little catfish curry and rice. Then I headed up to the East Coast, reaching up my fishing partners them. Hey. Are we gonna fry some fish? Are we gonna do some maintenance work in the yard, right? So let me continue. Or matter of fact, let's begin the adventure. I want you to see something. I some all of my curry. So go down there. Egg ball. Now, over here, the rice is finished by then. And I gotta leave, I gotta go up to Montrose, right? So what I gotta do? I gotta eat egg ball with fish curry. That's how much I love fish curry. Alright? Message, the fish got to eat? Yeah, we just got to try that. Alright. I love to hear. Look yeah, at this pepper. Ooh. Some more salt. Look at the pepper there, boy. So I eat an egg ball and fish curry. How much y'all ever try it up? <laughs> or y'all need to try it? I swear, we just do some weird combination. Yes. <laughs> That's my middle name. Alright, that's the lie how it work. Mm. You know that boy? No rabbit. I have the mouth of steel. Mm. Cheers. Oh, I have more Cheers. Mm -hmm. One more shark. You want to take another? What do you shark did on it? Eh eh. Now I didn't know egg ball and catfish curry tastes so sweet. I wouldn't eat back rice. Hey, but bile and fry bodies, cassava we just use. And say. catfish is be the best yeah. thing, bile and fry, cassava and catfish, and cassava made the um, egg balls. Yeah. Cheers. So, alashin, bile and fry cassava, and catfish curry. The goodness continue. Cheers. Look, I run into one of my big party, here, man. What's your name? Nice to meet you, Alana. At Kelly hey, Shop. Kelly Shop, right over here. Yes. Watch. This way you can come and get all your ice, your beer, your liquor, liquor wholesale. Absolute Good everything. price. Yeah, cheap price, right? Yes. Well, yes. today, look what we're going to do. Uh -huh. Me and my fisherman crew, we're going to. I got a, a place up the East Coast. I know. We're going to picnic and lime there a little all bit, right. man. All right, well, enjoy and be safe. Thank you. All Glad right. I run into you, man. Yeah, right. yeah. One love. Thank you. All right. All the best. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, bye bye. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'll check out this man shop here. Let's come and get my thing down here as well. My sure. ice and my liquor and thing. Let's see what. Ginger ale water. And my Eldorado and other things down here, you know. Alright, so I make a drive through the sea wall for show you how we're going on. And in the meantime, look who I got over here, by My number hey, one fishing partner. Good afternoon, yeah. everyone. Alright, my boy Anthony, man. 
All right, and I got my kiss spice there, the youngest fisherman in the crew. Good. So, you know, high tide right now, and the folks here on the seawall, you know, they're setting up now, it's two o'clock. The folks, them setting up for when the lime worms can come out this afternoon. But you see the water, the high tides topping over the seawall, messing up the seawall, yeah, man. I think our, our tourism authority needs to do more in terms of cleaning up and setting up our tourist destination. I understand, yes, you have COVID there wrong and thing, but I mean, the laws are relaxed here in Guyana. I believe they should have some mechanism in place, man, to clean up this beach and, you know, because when, when visitors come to Guyana, we don't really have much to show them. Trust me, we don't. All right, we need to nice up something like Suriname. Take a page of the Suriname book by water cant. You saw the man that is up the um the water cant here. Whenever we go as guys, when I go there we just gonna lime on the on, on the on the river front there by water cant. And you know have a good time and it really paved nice and really clean and it's well kept. We we need to look at our neighbors and you know take a page out. With that said, let me continue. You know um I, I don't really want to say too much in terms of for, uh, for my channel to, to, to sound uh, political and stuff but hey I'm talking about tourism, what's going to attract and I'm a man trying to bring tourists to our country and I think I may want to share my two cents what I think is going to attract tourists we need tourist destinations we need them to be well maintained and you know so it's going to attract look, somebody clean the drains here but I ain't pick up the garbage what do you think going to happen when the rainfall and the water road over, overflow it goes back right back into the drain this is what we need to do Clean the drain and pick up the trash at the same time. And by the weeding, you know, get somebody to pick it up. Come on, man. Come on. Whoever responsible. All right. This is what I love to see. The person who weed here, they already bag off the grass for a truck to come and pick it up. This you could accept, but you could understand well, you know, this is progress. So, hey, I got to give, you, you have to compliment when the compliments are needed, all right? So I am complimenting these fellas who weed up here and are cleaning up, you know, bagging off the um, garbage. It's real nice. I look, the man, the man right now, they may weed in me. Look. All right? So whoever doing the forest set, please. Y'all make sure y'all pack y'all thing in garbage bags so the truck can pick it up easily. So we arrive at our liming spot. And look at the beauty here, boy. Look at the geography here, boy. Man, you got the Gaisuku pumping station over there that, you know, pumps out water. When the rain falls a lot, you know, and the, the tides are high. You have this pump, and you have the one across there. And look at, I, I finally have access to a coconut tree, boy. You got to pick coconuts. Look at that. You got a little shed there. You're going to be washing up with meat and be fish and thing later on, you know. I got to make a shed down here. But only fire side and thing you know on, on lime. So I used to work down here with Mr. Lindy back in the days, you know. So I got some good old memories with this yard. And look, the only fisherman I guess so far, my boy Anthony and Mikey Spice, right? So we just bring in all them stuff. You know, we gotta clean up the yard, man. We gotta tear down this old building here. Clean up the yard, don't plant some fruit tree and thing. Hey, I got I see some soccer tree at the back there, you know. So, this is the beauty of the countryside. You know, tell her you always want a countryside home. Well, I get one here now. Life can't get better than this, trust me. This is what I dream about, to get a house in the countryside. Got my little fireside kitchen. Plant my fruit tree. And I get authorization to do what I want with the property. So don't worry, I can be planted. All right, you see we got the things there. We ain't got nobody for come join me yet, you know, them fishermen. In really, um, some of them buys their fishing from the west side. And look here, boy, look what we got here. We got a Valentine's 12, we got a MacArthur's. We got some smart half there, boy. Only problem, Anthony and me don't drink. So, I know who gonna be drinking now. We gonna be drinking squeezy. Don't worry, see, we got all these seasoning and thing there. We got this stove. Hey, we gonna be liming here, boy. And who drink and can, can go home? We got rooms, you know. Look at that. Trust me, we got rooms. All right, so how can life get better than this here, boy? So all y'all who got house to caretake, 
you have to contact here you know I got KJK allows you with Barbies bar tickle linden once I can come and cook and have a picnic a day out by y'all place me not problem once I got fruit street or if not I can plant fruit street just give me the keys to the house I don't care take it for y'all all right good life couldn't get better Anthony you like the location Mike yes I will lend you the keys, buddy. Come up anytime here and picnic. Yeah. Alright. Nice. Mikey Lash, buddy. Fish Korean rice. Yeah, fish Korean rice, buddy. Mikey Lash, alright. <laughs> now, yeah, I know I just love to run everybody backyard, right? Now look at this. Mike, please don't walk on the fines, right? Look there. We got a pumpkin there. And look at this one size here, boy. Look at this pumpkin, Anthony. Pumpkin, boy. Best thing to cook, no, we can't key. Our pumpkin curry and roti, boy. All right, guys, we got pumpkin to carry home here, boy. Look right there. Nice. At least you know this yard bearing fruit. Lovely, lovely. Somebody, I just got another pumpkin here too. All right. So, hey. Yeah, I see the the beauty of life. Watch, watch, cook, not there, boy. Even though the yard, you know, got a lot of bushes and things, we still got fruits. We got, we got a vegetable there. This look like a fire side, oh boy. Yes, look like a fire side. There we gotta make some bush cook. All right. Look, here another pumpkin there that dry up, boy. Nice, nice. We got some cleaning up here, you know. All right, and let me see the back. I know we had some banana tree at the back here. All right. So we got some banana tree there, but it didn't look like we got no banana on it. Later on, we can get bananas. A nice coconut tree at the back there, by Beautiful. Hey, this is what I dream about. I'm now realizing that dream, all right? I'm gonna want to catch my fish and go over there and catch tilapia and even shrimp and things, but one who has some Korean thing coming out from the cane, feel at the back. All right, look, coconut there, bio. Whoa! I remember this house here, bio. I used to be liming in this house, you know. I used to work in Mr. Lindy back in the days as a mechanic, as a welder. Hey. Got some fun memories here, man. All right, so the goodness continue. And if you are wondering what a two tank doing at the top there, you just pump up water from the pipe and store it in those tanks, and then you have gravity feed and you, and you supply the building with water, so you don't have to use a pressure pump. It's what most guys in these does. They have your tanks in the air. Look at neighbor over there. They got a tank in the air as well. Most people got tank in the air store water and then you get gravity feed all the time so if you get blackout because it's something we just normally get you know blackout power failure in Guyana so if that happen you'll still get water in your house and most people can't really afford a um, generator so hey you can grow you can feel the breeze look at the, 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 the coconut tree how it moving from side to side how the power the leaves moving you can feel the breeze down here boy and this is a vat. When the rain falls, you have you know you have gutters and pipes leading to the vat, storing the water, the rainwater. That way you just drink. This is what we used to drink back in the days. Well, of course now you know you got distilled water, right? But growing up, this is what we drink. I got visit uh, my friend Pinky. We went to Jandy and she bring parcel for me, man. Thank you very much. All right, and you're a big fan of the show, too, right? Yes. All right, all right, all right. I see. We got to buy some here and we, uh, we still waiting for the fisherman to come for the we start this party, you know. We done fire up the stove, you know. And this stove come all the way from Florida, my boy Cromwell, thanks to you. And look, look how we decorate this house here. This is the fisherman cabin, you know. We're frying pan there, boy. All right. Oh. Look at that. <laughs> Life can't get better than this. Next, we got the aisle. And after that, it's fish. And we got fish, you know, fish in the bucket. Let's see what I go out here, boy. Anthony, we don't have fish on the line right now. We got fish in the bucket, boy. We defrosting the fish here right now. Look, okay. Banga Mary. We got some nice trout. Oh, and I want to show you all the 
the big prawns is actually is tiger prawns, the tiger shrimp. Look at the size that they see. Remember the other day I do a video with um with the big shrimp? Look at this bro. This look, this is a this is a four gallon bucket watch. It's like 12 inches of shrimp big. They call it tiger shrimp. Anthony, you ever seen this before? I've seen this I've seen this thing. I've seen this thing. Seen it before, yeah, it, it's another YouTuber that show it from um them Asian country man. Them fellas just sketch it in Asia. Big, big. We dicing up the fish now. Just so we can start frying. Right? We in a green season here. I mean, I uh, bring a blend and all them fancy things. So I got fish seasoning. I put two cubes. I got some garlic powder and some lemon pepper. And my boy Anthony here paying attention. Our classes right now, right? Exactly. Good. So this is what I'm gonna do here right now. With the amount of fish, I probably got about five, about five pounds or four pounds of fish. Add your water this here, right? And this I already got salt inside. Please note. Read your seasoning properly, yeah? Just the salt. And this here I already got salt in it too. The lemon pepper, right? This one give it a lemonish taste. You got a little ah. You got a little garlic in here. Pepper and lemon. And salt. Add a little pinch to your like this, right? And remember, Cuba also carries salt, right? Has salt in the ingredients. So you can know your seasoning. Alright. So I will be adding no additional salt. So Anthony taking classes right now. You taking classes to mine? <laughs> yes, but I know how much I can have. Able to take it. I know no, 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 you will, you will. And this is the main ingredient garlic. The fry fish, one of the best ingredients garlic and ginger, but I ain't got ginger today. You put as much as garlic to taste. As much as you like, right? Whoa. The wind's so high blow, the way the seasoning. Alright? And then you want to mix all that goodness up. Alright, so this is a man's kitchen, alright? We ain't got a sink and thing as yet. You gotta install a sink. You know, get the water running. The water you're running right now. So, we gotta fetch water from downstairs, on the lower flat. All right, so this is good here. Butter it in flour, and we're gonna start cook across there. The brand new stove out of Florida, boy. The pan hot, you see? We got some smoke coming around there, which means, Anthony, please bring the pan over. All right, still going at it. I'm sure we're not in the pan here, Mikey. Let the viewers them see what we're not in the pan there. When you're dropping them fish, I mean, sizzling over here. See them? And remember, if the pan full, don't force too much fish inside. All right? All right. Anthony, what else we need now here, right? We got fried fish in good atmosphere. We got this there. What else we need, man? What else do we need? Huh? Um, <laughs> you know? I don't think we're ready. <laughs> what you want here, man? What you want here? We need the little, little, little tune, you know. We need some tune. Oh, the music. Alright, something else. What are you knocking by? You're knocking some plantain, some valentines, or you're knocking some uh, macarta? What do you think we should ask? Actually, any one of those, right? No, 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 you got to choose one. Alright, no problem. What are you knocking? What are you knocking? My choice is the, is the, is the valentine. No problem. When you, when you, you want to go, walk up. You walk it up? I don't know. So we're knocking some fine whiskey, and this is it. Compliments from my boy Decor's Narain, Narain from Barbie Skelland. The man own Decor's stationery and computer supplies. Skelland. Thank you, buddy. Fishing the Karahi bubbling. It's Sunday afternoon in the country. Hey, I can boss a shot. Come, come, come. Nakating, nakating, man. Oh, yeah, you take the COVID shot. You can knock. You come through, you come through, you can knock. You see? I can't drink, you know. I fast in. So then I can laugh. Very ice in the arm, the cool out there. Eh? Y'all do y'all thing by y'all. Hey, look at this big shrimp here, boy. Oh. Good things, you know. I got to turn on this stove a little. Nice. Let me show you, Anto. Yeah, the aisle over, have to know. 
All right. Look what's going on here, boy. <laughs> Life can't get better than that. All right, all right. The goodness continue. All right, so we're going to batter some more fish. Hey, y'all cheers, y'all cheers. Come on, Anthony, get a drink there before I fry this fish. Come, come, come. Y'all got cheers in you know. Please, a bottle of water. You got cheers in them, boy. Cheers, gentlemen. Cheers to cheers, the cheers. fish. Cheers, cheers. To the fish, right? Cheers, buddy. All right. <laughs> I was thirsty for a drink. <laughs> Mikey, you like a drink, boy? Of water? Yeah. You got water there? You got ginger ale? Or you got cranberry, right? Hey. Mm. You got to taste the fish, you know? Tell me what I go on, boy. Why are you on? It's so hot, boy. This is memory mm. from the crown, well, probably. Yeah. The, the crown, well, the back end we used to have is that okay, right? Yeah. Yeah, buddy. Well, try I like the fish. I don't really yeah. eat fish, but I'm going to try something. Try it. Though. All right, good. No problem. Many cooler. Huh? <laughs> All right. Come on, they're missing out. Yeah, the crown, well, they're missing out, you know. They're in Florida. <laughs> well. Can't get fresher than that. Yeah. <laughs> Anthony. Mm-hmm. What? You want more back or what? <laughs> hey, simple things that you can do to enjoy life, celebrate. Yeah. You really want to say the fish tastes good? Anthony said, all the fish tastes good. Good? Okay. Nah, it tastes good for truth, it tastes good. Trust me. It tastes good, it tastes very good. But I wait at last to give you all the, 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 the review. Let they tell you. It's crispy and it's well seasoned. And if you your taste, it's not too much salt. It's, yeah. it's, it's like perfect. And I got a sort of a lemonish taste into it there, right? Hey, the goodness continues. So, I'm gonna finish up frying these things there. We go out on the balcony there, we're gonna sit down and take the breeze. We're gonna lime. Hopefully, Miss Finch and I'm sure the girls them come. Or, the fisherman part and them come. You see this man taking school and this man making sure he collect them seasoning and things while using, you know. This man is the cook man too, alright? We got a tiger shrimp. Frying there, you know. <laughs> Thanks to my boy Arjun Pasad, boy. The man gifted me the two shrimp, you know. And this shrimp, I ain't seasoning it, you know. No seasoning. The actual shrimp. We eating them just like that. This man eating fish for the first time. How do fish work? Working proper. Good. Proper things, you know. <laughs> Alright, don't you got the pepper sauce? Hey, I gotta try to the pepper sauce. Hey, the evening, as the sun, the sunlight fading, the evening is getting more and more romantic more beautiful the breeze blowing more cool hey how can life get better than this here boy so we got it we got a shrimp here right now we're gonna taste all right this is the tiger shrimp the other here is an extra nice because the pump walking eh? Look at this here, boy. Uh -huh. This one is smaller than the one that we had tonight. Bye, bye, bye. Arjun Pasad. This is a smaller one. Look at this, boy. Mm. Tiger shrimp's really sweet, you know. Give me a review then. Right? How you taste Anthony? Good, good. Amazing? Amazing. Alright. Well, I know how it's supposed to taste the first time, but it tastes good. Lovely. <laughs> Delicious. <laughs> Lovely, alright, good. Hey, Mikey, what happened you and taste in the shrimp? Where did I put it? Don't tell me like, you know, if it didn't taste good, talk. You were good? <laughs> alright. So what happened there, boy? It's um, it's two, four, it's five of you. We got four pieces left. Alright, I'm gonna cut back one. Got everybody got equal share, right? Hold this, there, Mikey. So we got we got four pieces left. So we got we got split one and two. Got the shrimp walks up on. Everybody got your one piece, all right? Cheers. Go. Hey, we continue to enjoy the atmosphere here in beautiful Montrose on the East Coast. We lime in, we lash it with nice fried fish there. 
by France, then by Lachon de Whiskey, enjoying the evening. I ain't see Miss Lynch come yet with the girls. They promised me they're coming, you know. I ain't see them come yet. While I hate board watching, now, you see on that green building there, there's a lot of birds on top of that building, a lot of pigeons. And you can see some scarlet ibis or a crane. Way over that side, this is scarlet ibis. You know, I continue to say to um, the GoPro company, please make the zoom features while recording so I can zoom up and show you all the scarlet ibis. And that's the, the East Coast Highway right there, the public road. Over there used to be the Starlight Driving Cinema. Can I remember uh, in the days they had the Starlight Driving Cinema? I used to be over there. Now the Massey Company from Trinidad, they have a huge supermarket and warehouse over there. So hey, don't forget to have picnic pumpkin over there, you know. Miss Lynch can make pumpkin curry and roti tomorrow. With some nice shrimp. So we got a little bit slime here. The fun continue. This is the beauty of Montrose in the afternoon by I used to lime them street this year back in the days, you know, my neighbor here had a nice bear garden. Right? And this is the metro um, warehouse where I used to work back in the 90s. And look, Bobby's hangout bar there by big place, you know, you wanna get you a couple of beer, your nice cutters. Real nice place. I see you going on it. They get brand new road, buddy. Whoa! We gotta come live here regular, you know. Oh, yeah, I see the big Massey store over there. Much. Massey trading, the supermarket, and other business they have. Them kids get smooth road. You know, this this never happened back in the days, you know. They showed built a couple weeks ago, I guess. Watch, see them little by there? They're scooting around. All right, all right. The goodness continued on. Let's play my boy Vicari tune now, either. A gallopin, a gallopin. Hey, Vicari, what's here, boy? Shout out to you, eh? Thanks for using your music, man. You make Guyana proud and Guyanese. Watch your heart! Look at them, buddy, to celebrate your song there, buddy. Watch. All right. Now, watch, we got a little music box here, though. Watch your heart! Until it's gone. Hey, go on, to go. Up and run away, baby. Didn't wanna stay, baby. I got an answer. <laughs> Love for you is true. Gallopin, a gallopin, a gallopin, a gallopin. Tell me, never gonna leave. Gallopin, tell me that you're never gonna leave. Gallopin, tell me that you're never gonna leave. Cheers by cheers. Hey, knock a thing, knock a thing, knock a thing. All right. All right, all right. Hey, life can't get better, why? We jump it up, we celebrating, enjoy in the afternoon. Eh? No other fisherman didn't come, so I'm missing come neither. So what are we gonna do? We gotta celebrate myself and you know? And enjoy the evening. I try to fly my drone, but due to Ogle Airport, close proximity of Montrose is restricted area. I can't give you an aerial view of that area, alright? I gotta seek permission from Ogle Forest. So hey. We don't know what the evening hold is yet. Are you still my shorts, sir? Anthony, huh? read my shorts. I can't. So give me coffee to change the things I can. And give me whiskey to accept everything I can't. Lovely. <laughs> All right. Y'all have been tell me that you're never gonna leave. Uh -huh. All right, I want to big up my, my, my boy Tony Cotsto from Guyana. You hear the man tune there? <laughs> where you been, my Eldorado, where you been? Look, I got some goats in the yard. and know what you're going on over there. Right. Y'all see it? Somebody got behind you in there. Barto, please lock the gate. Leave the goats in the yard. They have a lifetime supply of grass in here. And then we got curry the goat later. <laughs> my, my boy said goat curry over there. <laughs> anyway. We don't know what the afternoon has to offer, what the evening has to offer. We might end up at Bobby Bar just now, you know. Check out the bar. But for now, I want to thank you all for your time on this channel. You know, I really appreciate you being here. If you like what I am doing, 
please spread the word tell a friend about ARD all right share my videos so more people like yourself can see what Guyana has to offer all right hit that like button if you like my show so I can make more videos for y'all take care of you take care of those around you God bless you stay safe peace out and see you on our next adventure